Hello, this is Brian Perry with Canfax to provide your cattle market update. We're May 28th today and continue to see improvement across the marketplace. Uh, packing plants in Western Canada continue to ramp up production. Uh, you know, many days operating at 75% or higher in some spots. Uh, continue to be good for moving cattle through the supply chain. Eastern Canada continues to plug along, running still near full capacity. Uh, working through their supplies and, and even we're seeing cattle out of Western Canada being shipped to Guelph to, to fill some slaughter spots there. So certainly good for the supply chain to keep these cattle moving. Uh, prices uh, continue to strengthen here. We've actually got cattle uh, prices in Ontario certainly at a premium to the west and both Ontario and Alberta fed cattle prices above a year ago. Uh, fed cattle prices in, on, in Alberta this week are in the low 150s. Um, again, somewhat on restricted volumes. Certainly there's a lot of cattle ready to go to market, but packing plants uh, working with producers to lift the, the cattle that most need to be lifted and uh, hopefully continue to uh, increase their production to, to pull these other cattle forward and, and work through the supplies. Uh, this is transferring uh, across the supply chain as we're seeing prices of all cattle improve. Cows, you know, pretty limited volumes, but uh, again, prices well into the 80s and maybe even 90 cents in spots for cull cows. Uh, calves, anything destined for grass, extremely strong demand there. Um, seeing five weights push well over 230 and, and uh, you know, even seven weights now hitting $2 or, or a little more in spots. So extremely strong demand. Feeder cattle also improving, you know, eight weight steers that had been under a lot of pressure starting to seasonally strengthen. Uh, now seeing some of them into the low 180s, obviously for the greener uh, type fleshier cattle, certainly going to be back 10, 15 cents on, on eight weights. But uh, again, overall, much stronger prices than we've seen recently. And, uh, and we continue to move forward in, in a positive uh, marketplace as uh, beef demand remains strong and uh, cattle supplies continue to move.